All right, everybody, welcome back to the channel. We're here with another part of this Red Dead Redemption walkthrough. We're back here in Armadillo after the last parts died, unfortunately, right at the end. Um, so we're going to start off with, we have two options for missions available. We have Nigel West Dickens and Irish all the way up at Thieves Landing. Uh, we're going to start with Nigel West Dickens. I want to see what he has available. I already got a waypoint set to it. Uh, if there's not a follow-up right after with Nigel right immediately again, or a Bonnie mission popping up, then I'll head up to Irish. Um, but for now, I want to see Nigel West Dickens. I feel like we haven't seen him in a little bit. Come on. He should have the, he, the... Last time we talked to him, he was talking about armor plating for the carriage. Uh, so hopefully he has that set up already. We've been dealing with Irish in the minigun, or the Gatling gun. Sorry, don't call it a minigun. But ho hopefully he has that all set up, or we might be uh, grabbing the plates in this mission. Actually, now that I think about it, we might end up doing it. It seems like every mission we have, we're doing all the heavy lifting, all of the actual work. So, <laughs> I feel like I'm going to end up actually having to do it. It's been... Uh, I keep on mentioning this, but it's been so long, I just don't remember the missions. I'm going to cut across the lane. What am I doing? I don't have to follow the trail every second. Okay, maybe in that case you follow the trail. But, uh, it's been so long since I played this game, I just, I don't really remember anything. So I'm, I'm, I'm really playing this game blind all over again. Um, I've, I've had a good time with this game so far, to be fair. The dialogue in this game is actually very good. There's been so many times where, I mean, you've probably seen it watching me play this game so far, but so many times where he's just like actually entertaining dialogue. So many games nowadays, it's just the dialogue is so bland. It's just, I don't want to replay the game again because I'm just like, okay, I gotta sit through this talk, this dude talk for 40 minutes. But this game, it's it's refreshing to revisit some of these older classic games um, and, and seeing the dialogue, just actual humor in, involved. Not just like some corny one-liner. Or corny punchline thrown in there to oh add some humor. It's actually just like people making fun of each other over and over, just roasting each other. Just the especially the dialogue with Irish that was actually like actually good. I very much enjoyed that. Ooh, let's actually start the cutscene here. Mr. Marston, sir, John Marston. Mr. Marston, don't be so childish. Come on, sir, I implore you. Okay, 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 so I made a few innocent mistakes when last we met, but my plan is still sound. Together we can conquer, if not the world, then certainly Bill Williamson. But first, you need me to do you a favor? <laughs> You read my mind. I can only deduce you have been taking my tonic, sir, as instructed. It can give the most ordinary of intelligences a remarkable insight. I'll give you insight. I'll show you what your guts look like. Please, sir, this show of petulance is nothing short of embarrassing. Think for a moment, sir. Think. I'm thinking about how much of my time you're wasting. <laughs> um, sir. Sir. I am about to do something which I greatly discourage in all wise and rational men. A selfless act for you. But, sir, before I act selflessly, allow me to act selfishly and sell some of my wares. Fair enough. Oh, good, sir. Come, and let's go visit some of our fine friends in the other oil business we have here in Plainview. These men need all the help they can get. <laughs> So we're just uh, participating in his scams, it seems. Mingle with the crowd. Yeah, like they don't see me walking and talking to Nigel. <laughs> Friends! Hardware! 
working souls of uh, Plainview, do you suffer from rheumatism, lumbago, acute chronic sciatic, uh, neurologic, or inflammatory pain? Well, I represent the only company that makes the genuine article which cures headache, neuralgia, uh, toothache, earache, backache, Broad. swelling. This man is a fucking charlatan. He just got done swindling us down at Cho Springs with this song and dance. I say we tar and feather him right I now. I say we shoot the uh, bastard. I think it's time we take our business elsewhere. Uh, I apologize if science is not your forte. Good day, one and all. Oh, we're gonna have to escape? Okay. Saint Homer Bonner is not gonna get down. Am I am I shooting these guys? Homer Bonner's the hate and state of business man. I'd say he's giving you your just dessert. Poppycock! Those things were clearly informed of my defund policy. You can only shit on people for so long before they decide it's their turn to pull down the pan. A crude metaphor in every sense of the word, my dear boy. You need the business to me. Do I try to tell you how to rob banks? Robin banks no more honest. Am I this. supposed to be shooting me? Is is this is this actually giving me a, a bad rap here? Okay, I'm not committing any crimes yet. They are chasing us. I just want to make sure. Wait, what? Horse theft? How do I have a horse theft? Counts of horse theft. Oh, that, that triggers me. Oh, that... Oh, wait, what? $20 bounty. How do I... How do I have a $20 bounty? Oh, okay. This was part of the mission. I'm being dumb. Because we had the mission when we first met um, Seth. Where we had to distract the sheriff for Seth so he can uh, speak to Monty? More, Yeah, Monty. Okay, that's actually part of the mission. Then we had to escape from the sheriff. Okay, I'm being dumb. I just want to make sure uh, this isn't going to get me. This isn't. This isn't going to be a crime. But what? Well, doesn't seem to be. You know what? Let's go to a. Good shot. Let's go to the repeater. I like this gun way more. Hold on. Dude, how many guys are going to pop up? There is so well, many guys chasing us like right now. It's a train. I'm killing so many people. I don't know. Trying to protect this dude's scams. Why you shot my boy? Look, oh, they ahead of us. Up ahead. I'll be down. Excellent job. Now let's make haste. Wave a second. Okay, we just killed so many people For just to protect this people. dude's scam sure scams. I am up against the weight of plebeian ignorance, my boy. Keep that gun at the ready, my dear boy. Oh, there's more guys coming, aren't there? Maybe you need to think about a change of career. I will never give up on science, John. Ooh, he's gonna crash now. Don't start bugging out on me. How can these people harbor such bitterness? Dude, you're scamming well, I ain't them. That tonic I drank at Ridgewood went through me like a dose of salt. <laughs> really, all I want to know is how to participate more hard horse races. The only thing Nigel has uh, done useful is yes, introducing it. those horse races. I want to do another one. I feel like these guys are going to... I have so much ammo for this gun. It's it's insane. Who do you think you are? Here they come. Who? Oh, I see the wagon over there. I 
see this wagon where to go. Keep an eye on the mini map here. Dude, have they sent the whole population of New Austin after me? Because I've killed at least a couple dozen people here. We made it, John! There's Quavosek up ahead! Nobody else chasing? Is that it? Ooh, horse. Is this place? Thank you, my dear boy. You saved the day again. What are we doing here? It always impresses me with the speed with which a group of men can turn from passive sheep into murderous wolves. I'm impressed with how you nearly got us killed back there. Well, uh, yes, uh, perhaps we should shell the tonics business for a period. Let's say we try our hand at racing again. There's a meet at Rathskeller. You're trying my patience, Mr. West Dickens. Well, I'm sorry, dear boy, but I'm only an aging vendor of exotic elixirs, not the bloody U.S. Cavalry. Forgive me if matters take some time to prepare. So are we going to have a follow-up with another horse race, or is it just a... Uh... A new thing that is available. Oh, there's a follow-up. Okay. Mr. West Dickens. Ah, Mr. Marston. How wonderful to see you, sir. How wonderful. Are we ready, then? Uh, yes, sir. Uh, nearly, sir. Very nearly, sir. I just need some cash to get some extra hardware fitted to my old Trojan horse here. You, you what? Uh, never mind, sir. I can only presume that you have not enjoyed the benefits of a classical education, so I will not take umbrage if some of my illusions sail over your head, sir. I won't pretend to understand you, but I will endeavor to make you understand me. Either we do this right now, or I put a bullet in you and get on with my day. Please, I knew you were a violent man, Mr. Marston, but I did not think you were a stupid one. We need money to outfit my carriage, to turn a simple tradesman's vehicle into something more subterfuge. <laughs> and I'm about to tell you how we are going to gain said cash. Now I know that you ride very well. So come, sir, to Rathskeller Fork. <laughs> Let's go, my dear boy. This is the I'll stuff I'm talking about right way. here, where he's literally just like roasting, roasting John. He's just roasting John. Um, so how are you, John? Maybe okay, not getting a perfect education. Standard. Hopefully we can get through today without running into another army of your satisfied customers. Onwards and upwards! I refuse to let the blind stupidity of the proletariat derail my calling in life. I just realized my horse is following me. I'd say they saw right through you. Ah, before knowledge comes down, my dear boy. Everybody knows you're as crooked as a dog's hind leg, Wes Dickens. I resent that implication, John. I wasn't implying. I was telling. You're such a successful businessman. What are you doing living in a cave? Delightful and Dickensian, isn't it? If you say so, are you familiar with the concept of philanthropy, John? I'm surprised you are. Oh, I don't do any of this for myself. <laughs> this is what I'm talking Bob. about. That is so that. good. You're crazy, old man. It's been quite a ride, John, hasn't it? We haven't gone that far. No, I mean us. Ridgewood Farm, Gap Tooth Breach, Plainview. We make quite a team, you and me. Brains and brawn. We should consider a more permanent partnership. This partnership ends as soon as I have Bill Williamson. I appreciate your help, but I've just about had it with all your schemes. You need to realize what's at stake here. I know, John, I know. Just win this race and we'll be ready. I give you my word. Okay, well that's good to know. I mean, I, I like the races anyways. Like I said, it's... It's tricky. There it is, John! Rathskeller Park! Okay. The, ra the races sometimes can be tricky. Just the, the horrible controls for ra controlling your horse. Sometimes a little tricky, but still. It's, it's an entertaining time. So 
we just take our place at the start line or what? Let's get to it. Is it a carriage race? Oh, sorry, I gotta get a horse. Come on. I already have a horse. There, oh, so it's not a carriage race, thank God. It's just a regular horse race. This will be a fair race. No shooting, stabbing, cliff pushing, rock throwing, cactus grinding, neck lassoing, setting fires, or other acts that causes a rider to unfairly lose his way, nor bleed heavily, or black out. Get yourselves ready. Set. Go. I'm not going to talk too much during this race. Trying to maintain my lead here. I guess they get nice wide trails in this one at least. Nice wide trails. This one's way better than the last race. Oh, and I sp spoke too soon. I still got a good lead. Is this going to be a super long race again? Go. Get some speed on the straightaways. I said I was going to talk, but this is, uh, this is an easier race than the last one. Okay, where is the end, though? That's the only problem with these races. It's like, I have no clue when it's going to end. Straight away, get some speed going. Another straight away. There we go. Why am I treating this like an F1 game? <laughs> I keep on calling everything straight away. Let's go. Okay, I'm gonna maintain my stamina here, but I want to keep my lead. I don't want to choke right at the end. We have to be right at the end here. Yep. Okay, I see the finish line. Come on. Follow through. There we go. Okay, that was fun. Let's let's do a bunch more of these. He saw, he conquered. <laughs> now he shouldn't bug me again for any more missions, right? John. Let's take a moment to bask in the glory of our victory. Have we got enough money now? Yeah, all right, all right, all right. Uh, yes, once Seth and Irish have furnished their side of the bargain, I think we should be ready. Quite a team we've assembled, don't you think? Yeah, now I just have to deal with Irish. Marco, grave robber and a drunk. How could things possibly go wrong? That's a good team, to be fair. How does Irish actually seem the most useful? Now that I think about it. Why, hello. Irish the drunk is the most useful person that we have. That's sad. Okay. Oh, wait. Blackjack games. What else is that? Is that a horse breaking? Or is that a race? I want to see what that is on the uh, on the map right here. What is this? Horseshoes. Okay, that's even worse. I'm never going to do that. 
See, I still have American Appetites available. Uh, ooh, it's going to be a long trip. Do we have a... There is no... I was going to say, there is no carriage around here, right? It's actually going to have to be the full trip. Because I might just head to Armadillo first. Check out American Appetites. It's the only one I actually want to do. Just for that outfit. I got to head this way anyways. Seems like I'm going to have to do the trip. Ah, kind of sucks. Head to Armadillo, do American Appetites, and then we'll, we'll book it towards uh, Thieves Landing so we can finish off what's remaining with Seth. Or not Seth, Irish. If, if we finish out from what Nigel West Dickens just said, if we finish out Irish's uh, Irish quest line, then we should be on to the assault on, what is it, Fort Mercer? Did I take a wrong turn already? How the freak did I... I got talk in there. Immediately took a wrong turn. Great. I hear gunshots. I'm gonna just ignore them. Okay. Never mind. I'm not gonna ignore them. Yeah, just... Just keep going. I'm not even gonna bother. I accidentally let that dude die. Dang it. Well, I already have a good amount of money. It doesn't matter. Let's just keep going. That is one thing. I need to utilize the carriages a little bit more on these long trips. I mean, there wasn't anything available in this case. But I know there is uh, on some of the bigger cities. Some of these are some really long trips. Wait, where's the, uh, where's the place to rent in this Ridgewood farm? I might as well go ahead and actually own some property everywhere, because I think you can... Wait, what am I doing? I can fast travel, can't I? How much does it cost? Oh, so this is literally just being able to save. Okay, that's not what I want. Let's, uh, I, I just re realized I can, uh actually be able to fast travel just um, let me get out i think you can't do it in a town or a settlement if we leave this area i should be able to set down a camp and head over to armadillo let's give this a try kit i think it's in kit right improved campsites and from there we should be able to fast travel to a different location Travel to destination. Let's go to Armadillo. I don't think I... The closest place I could go is probably uh, McFarland Ranch. But we'll start with Armadillo. I want to do it. Go ahead and do American Appetites. See what's available. Come on. Oh, there she is. Okay. I was about to say, where's she at? You okay, lady? My husband's missing. These bastards won't do anything. But he's a good man. He don't drink, nor lay with whores. And he's been, he's been missing for three days. Let me guess. You went missing up in the hills? How did you know, mister? Just a guess. If I find him, I'll bring him back to you. But people seem to go missing up there. <laughs> yeah, sorry to break oh the news God. to you, but... If he's gone, then what'll I do? We ain't got much money. And I'm in the family way again. As I said, I'll do what I can. <laughs> yeah. Uh, what, what the freak is causing this? This is the third person. Howdy. The third person going missing up there, so... I'm not really liking this. What is it? Are they just trying to abandon life or like what the heck is going on? Let's go. Where which way am I heading? Am I heading the right way? Map. I am pretty head pretty well heading straight towards it.
Check one more time. Where are we at? Okay, even further up the hill. Where's that wolves or coyotes? I think that's coyotes. Okay. Oh my god. I did not know you were there. Oh, no way. Actually, now that I think about it, is it the freaking leopard? This is a messy one. Was it leopards killing people? Uh oh, I hear. My lord, get up, get up, get up, get up. Dude, this is insane. Wait, this is... Oh my god, I just failed that. No way. Why was he highlighted red? I'm so confused of what's going on. Can I run that back? I don't know if I... I think I might have just ruined everything. I might have just... Ah... Uh, what do I do there? <laughs> um... Can I not do that? Oh, that sucks. I'm gonna have to find out. Probably later on. Oh, I don't know what's going on here at all. Oh my freaking lord, get the freak up. It's definitely these. It's definitely these. Get the freak back down here, horse. I ain't staying in this area. Is that a... What is that? Is that a freaking boar? Let's get the freak out of here. Let's go. Dude, I ain't staying in this area. This sucks. I, I really hope I can run that back. Because that sucks if it's just over with. Okay, let's make the long trip over to Thieves Landing. Probably going to go ahead and uh, maybe fast travel over to McFarland Ranch. Come on. Let's get back on the road, though, away from all the freaking Jaguars. That is horrible. Whoa. I hated that. Okay, let's open up kits, move campsites, fast travel back to McFarlane Ranch. Oh my god, I really hope I I really hope I didn't just choke that and ruin everything. Armadillo McFarlane Ranch. I think that's the closest thing available to Thieves Landing that I have available. So we'll see. I oh god, I'm really nervous I just choked that and I don't have it available anymore. Yeah. Really hope not. That's gonna suck if I did. I think that's the only way to get the outfit. But why was that dude's icon red? That's an enemy icon. I'm so confused by that. I see him shooting. I should have figured he's not shooting at me. He's shooting at the freaking jaguars and coyotes and leopards and all types of animals around here. is going on there's these stranger missions i don't want to do all of them because i just don't have the time for them but they're interesting stories at least really need to focus more on the main campaign if we're actually if thieves landing is actually like a, a small town or like an actual bigger town i do want to explore around a tiny bit just to see what store they have available it seems like every place that's is this it already Oh, it is. Wait, mysterious stranger's friend. Perhaps you should give him some advice. Where is that at? I'll do that while I'm here. 
That's a rentable place. This is Stagecoach Taxi, Five Finger Filet. So it's a little further ahead, actually into the main area. I hope you're not like a bad person. I just I killed an innocent and so set free a criminal. That's all right. <laughs> you won't be troubling nobody else. Okay, I know you. I think it's in this building. Uh, encourage the man or discourage? Is he cheating? I, I'm gonna discourage the man. I don't know if that's the right choice. <clears throat> Excuse me, mister. Yeah, what the hell do you want? Look, don't ask how, but I know what you're about to do. You don't want to do this. The hell are you talking about? You know what I'm talking about, mister. I'm just here to say I don't think you should go through with it. Your wife, she loves you. Shit, mister. I don't know who or what you are, but I guess I'm grateful. I guess you're right. I was raised better than this. Okay, that worked out good, I think. Don't mention it. Go on now. I think that was the right choice. Okay, I, I mean, I, I kind of like that option. Where is... Oh, there's Irish. Okay. Let's go ahead and dive right into this. Up, sister. Put them up. Irish, what are you doing? Who the hell are you? Give me that. I'm your old friend, Amnesia. Oh, oh God, blimey. And I've come to tell you, if you ever pretend to forget my name and your debt to me again, I'll make sure you reach heaven before these two ladies. Now get down there. Oh, oh, oh Mr. Marston. Oh, how are you? Ashamed. Ashamed to know you. What the hell's wrong with you, robbing these gentlewomen and ladies of the Lord? I thought they was doxies. Oh. Ladies, I'm sorry about this man. He's unfortunately lost his mind to the demon drink. At least I hope he has, and he wasn't this stupid all along. So, uh, please excuse us. Now, Irish. A gallon gun doesn't work. I find that rather upsetting, don't you? Oh, heartbreaking. It doesn't? Which how is how why does he know I this? I was just coming to see you when the drink got the better of me. He keeps on waving that gun around. I hate it so much. Come on. Where's the discipline? I know where we can find the parts for you. Oh, mother fucking Mary. Yeah, okay. I take back what I said about him being the most useful. How about a drink or two, mister? You're barking up the wrong tree, lady. Huh? We're gonna get another gunfight, aren't we? At? What you looking at? Do what? not draw your gun. Drunk as I am, my fridge in fine working order. <laughs> what a lusty specimen you are. I like Ooh, that. That fresh air's got me head spinning like a top. Can't be good for a fella. Shut up, you lazy drunk. Before I stop your head spinning with a bullet. I resent that, Johnny. I've been working like a beaver on your behalf. Really seems You've like been he's been getting like drunk. A weasel on my behalf. <laughs> God, I love his, 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 his lines. You must have been raised on sour milk, Irish. What are you talking about? I'm a good Catholic boy. You're a booze blind coward. And you're a hypocrite, Marston. You've robbed just as many innocent folks as me. I tried to only rob those who had more than they deserved. Christ, the church has more money than anybody. Fair point. Where are we Don't going, Irish? Just to the warehouse Don't here in bus. Thieves Landing. I'm telling you, Johnny boy, bus. it's all set up. Brand We're meeting this pal of mine right at the back door of the office, hobble tongued feller by the name of Shaky. And he's got the ammunition we need? Jesus, stop fretting, will you? I knows about guns front, back, and sideways. You're gonna be real familiar with mine if things keep on this way. God, who, who, 
I don't I need to find out who voiced John Marston because he did a fantastic job. I love it so much. Just his All lines. Right, even the Stay writing close. is just great. I think this is called breaking and entering. Stutter and bastard said this would be open. Come on, let's see if we can get in around the back. Okay, yep, this Come is definitely gonna be breaking and entering. Don't turn this into an Assassin's Creed game where I'm just trailing people the whole time, please. I'm starting to think you're soft on me, Johnny boy. Can't even sneeze these days without you being there to catch the drift. This is your last chance, you good-for-nothing shyster. You've already wasted too much of my time. Pawn shop, I'll take it. Yeah, I feel like we're definitely gonna break in at this point. All right, we should be able to get in here. Stick with me and keep quiet. Yeah, I don't trust you, though. You're just such a lying, like he said, coward. Shake his made the arrangements, and he'll... Sounds like Shake has only gone and got himself found out. <laughs> all right. Now all we have to do is find out who you work with. You hear me? Shaky, you wretched fucking son of a whore. Suck my again! <laughs> oh. Labor relations don't sound like they're exactly at an all time high. You sneak in and get poor Shaky loose. I'll go get the wagon. Good luck, Master. Okay, once again, He's I do all the work, and shit. you do nothing. Great. All right, work your usual magic. I'll go get the wagon ready. Oh, I can't get in through that door. Okay. Climb the ladders. Oh, this ladder. Okay. Why do I have to do all the work? Everybody's useless but me. Wait, am I supposed to avoid detection? Hey, you hear that? Did I just blow my cover? I have like no ammo. Guess we're going back to the Cattleman revolver. Are we? I think we're going guns blazing here. Okay, everybody is a horrible shot. Please, please, mister. I'm 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 oh, I see Shaky. He stutters like crazy. Okay. Did I get more ammo for the... I don't have a lot for the volcanic. Wait. Let me loot these guys now. Ah, oh, I can't. Dang it. I want to see if I can get more ammo for the volcanic, because it's a good gun. Okay, Shaky, I get it now. You can fetch up for me and your friend Irish. Let me down, and you'll be a dead man. Okay. It's gonna be Fight our way out again. Once again, I do all the work. All right, let's get out of here while we got the chance. You want to stop doing that? Wait, is he actually being useful? Run away and maybe I won't kill you. I'll kill all you bastards. I'm gonna kill you. I'll see your bones bleach in the rain. Before 
There we go. Heal up. Open the door. I got got you covered. Me. Let me loot at least one guy real quick. Let's see. Open gate. There we go. Another shootout can already tell. Okay, that's garbage. There we go. Let's get reloaded first. Back to the Winchester. Where's the last guy at? Can I borrow this friend? Ooh, I took him out all back here. Wow. Okay, where's the machine gun ammo? Yeah. Now we're even. I should like Shaky the most. He's my favorite so far. To calm your nerves. <laughs> oh, that's uncalled for. More, you dirty fucking snake. All right, gentlemen. <laughs> Go. Okay, I like I like Shaky way more. Can we just replace him with Irish? Or Irish with him? Okay, we're gonna get another shootout. I killed a lot of men for this damn machine gun of yours. I'm sorry I missed all the dramas. You always miss all the drama. There must be cobwebs growing on that holster of yours. Someone's got to drive the wagon, don't they? Teamwork, Johnny boy. That's my game, not just the glory like you. Yeah, I knew we were going to have to defend the wagon again. Shoot those bastards! I'm going to hit from a cannon! Protect the wagon from bandits. I mean, we stole the ammo from them. Are, aren't we the bandits? Really ruffled a few feathers back there. Here come by them bastards. I don't like this mess. Behind me, they're like a bloody drone. Just drive, Irish. You're acting like a schoolgirl. Where are they coming from? They're not behind us yet, so. I'm telling you, Irish, that machine gun had better work after all this. Look out, there's one on the bridge up ahead. Okay. That worked. I don't know if I can take my car You're shooting my enemy. You're a real cold-blooded killer, Irish. Choice if somebody wants that ammunition real bad. Yes, me. Anytime you want to shoot somebody, Irish, please feel free. Hey, Spotoy, how many are there? How far is McFarland's ranch? None of a team, man, you. Oh, it's right here, okay. Making this a more permanent partnership. I think I've about had my fill of liars in this life, partner. Well, I think you're ready for parts, master. You've got enough ammunition here to take down a small country, fella. I'm going to need it. Bill Williams has got himself an army. So I guess this is where we part ways, Johnny Marston. Or maybe not, friend. You're going to be right alongside me when I take on that fort. After all you put me through, it's time you pull the damn trigger for once. Show me what a big, bad killer you really are. Uh, yes, of course. What am I thinking? Don't worry, you can count on me. I just hope I don't steal all your glory. Wouldn't be right or proper. I feel like you're not going to show up to this assault. 
Impressive, Marston. We'll have West Dickens's wagon rigged and ready to go soon enough. So what are we doing now? I mean, what is next? 150 fame. We've got a Marshall Johnson mission. But is this the... Oh, yes. This is definitely going to be the assault on Fort Mercer. Well, if the next mission is probably going to be the start of the assault on Fort Mercer, um, we're going to call this video a little shorter than normal. I, th I don't think there's any Bonnie missions or anything at the moment. Uh... I honestly think what's next is Fort Mercer. And if that's the case, we're going to call it quits for this part. Um, a little earlier than normal. We're still 46 minutes in, but if you guys enjoyed this part, make sure to like, subscribe, leave any feedback down below. And I'll see you guys next time. Take care.